Hi guys, welcome to the Entrepreneurial Minute, proudly brought to you by TheEntrepreneurialMind.com. This is the show where you get to ask Dr. Jeff Cornwall all the questions you need to. And we've had someone send in a question to Jeff at TheEntrepreneurialMind.com, and it is this, Doc. Is it crucial to get 51% of a partnership, or is 50-50 okay? Um, I probably get asked this question more than any other about, about partnerships. And the, and the kind of the... the the common wisdom is you should always try to negotiate to have 51% so you have control. And, and I think that there are times when that might be advantageous. Um, but when you have ultimate control, you're starting to kind of create a culture of you're the boss mm-hmm. and everybody else is kind of subservient. And you're really already setting that tone. Um, believe it or not, I really think that 50-50 partnerships, or if you have three people, a third, a third, a third, can be incredibly healthy kind of a culture to have and, and, and a great relationship. Uh, it forces you to make decisions not by voting, which if you're 51%, you get all the votes sure. and you win, but, but you really have to kind of develop trust and, and develop a, a process of consensus. Um, with my partners in our healthcare business, we, we were all fairly equal, three partners. There was a little variance, but it was pretty close. And, and, and our rule of thumb was, on, on, the, on the big decisions, all three of us had to agree. We never voted. Um, we could have set up a situation where two of us would vote and one would be outvoted, but we knew that was going to lead to resentment and, and discontent and, and, and not all of us working hard towards a common goal. The same thing happens when, when you've got 51% and you're the boss, mm-hmm. you're the one in charge. Uh, if you start wielding that kind of ultimate authority, you're going to dishearten your staff, and, and people aren't going to have that level of commitment and, and partnership with you that you need. So, so be patient. Create that 50-50 partnership and, and, and commit to each other that you're going to manage with cons- consensus. But what the, the one other thing I would say with this is you better make, make damn sure that you've got somebody you can work with and trust and, and can be in that kind of relationship with. So, so don't rush into these kinds of partnerships no matter what the split take the time to get to know each other. Yeah, and take some time to jump over to theentrepreneurialmind.com and check out, there's a whole section on partnerships as well. Dr. Jeff Cornwall has some mentors over there and just for a small subscription, you can join in the conversation. And thanks for joining in this conversation and we'll see you next time on The Entrepreneurial Minute. 